coming Monday, April the 18th, is opening day of uh, spring gobbler season in West Virginia. Okay, folks, it's JW of Stevens Family Outdoors. I just got finished moving my blind to a better spot, and uh, I'll take you outside and show you the, the exterior. But I'm going to switch around and show you some of the inside here. Okay. The camera's probably not focusing, but there's a peephole up one logging road. There's the other one. If you look close, you see the gate in my truck, which is a great big 40-acre field out there that they go out in every morning, eat grasshoppers and whatever. But before they do that, they usually cross right in front, right out of this logging road right there. It goes back through there between them bushes and comes right out in front of me probably about five yards. And that big tree over there is probably 10 yards, 12 yards from me. There's my one shot, first shot. If I don't get it, here's my second one. And if I don't get it there, then I just don't get it. Now, to make sure that I know he's coming down that logging road, I have a small peephole right here. And through those bushes there, if you look close, you can actually see the logging road. And I left some of the brush up there so that it would help camouflage a little bit here, this opening. and. Uh, if a turkey's walking in there, he's going to stick out like a sore thumb. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, take you outside in just a second. But I will be hunting with my traditional bow. Either my Bob Lee or my Black Widow. Not sure. Or I might even bring out my, uh, my custom bighorn by Fred Asbell. One of those three I'll probably bring out one of those for sure I'm not sure which one yet all right let's go outside okay folks here's what it's going to look like from the turkey's last view in life you can look through there it's dark in there of course we'll be wearing dark clothing inside of there we'll have all the back windows shut off so it doesn't reflect any light coming in plus two if you look there's a bunch of brush in behind me which helps and uh, there's that big field I was telling you about and the logging road that they'll be usually coming out of is right there it goes all the way out probably three or four hundred yards to uh, another big large field and a lot of times they roost in here one more thing here's the other direction goes out through there it's a logging road and uh, they like to travel down through there too the blind used to be over in that direction but I opted to bring it back over here not back over here but bring it over here uh, for this season and see what happens I mean I should be able to see him when he's back in there a good bit and go ahead and be, get ready to thump him on video alright folks this is JW Stevens Family Outdoors